Hi you guys, it's Friday, congratulations! We've made it together through an entire week and I couldn't be more proud to see every single one of you check in every single day. Every time I see that number and I log in, you guys inspire me and I want you to know that. Um, I want to talk about you know the commitment that you make to yourself. Um, a lot of times when we make a commitment to someone, say we make a commitment to pick up our kids from school or we make a commitment to our boss or to someone, you know, that commitment is like a stone. We wouldn't leave our kids, you know, on the sidewalk for, for some stranger to come pick up. We make that commitment to them and we, we show up. And, you know, when you decided to join this challenge, you made a commitment to me and to yourself to, to do this journey for the next four weeks. And so I want you guys to show up every single day. Let it be your non-negotiable. Schedule that time, you know, just like you wouldn't let your kids stand on the sidewalk for hours on end. If you've said you're going to wake up at 7 a.m. and do your workout at 7 a.m., just put your clothes on and push play and get it, get it done with and fulfill that commitment to yourself and to, to this group and, and, and do the workouts, okay? And then the other thing is I want you guys to just be patient and, and, um, and kind of patient with yourself, you know? Our journeys are not straight. They are anything but straight. They are, they, there's many ups and downs. There's curvy, you know, turns that we don't foresee. But, um, you know, what it is, is it's about trying. It's about getting up the next day and trying. You know, I had my major weight loss in 2013 where I started my health journey and I peaked in 2014. And after that peak, I was riding it and I felt great and I was feeling so fabulous for so long. And then I started gaining weight again. And it was really hard for me because here I was, you know, I had been inspiring people and coaching people. And then all of a sudden, I didn't feel like I had the solution anymore and I wasn't feeling great. And that was part of my journey. And you know, I still tried and I still showed up and I still did what I could. And now I'm, you know, I'm back on track and I'm feeling amazing again, but I've been patient with myself and I've been, you know, patient with the experience. And now, you know, I'm in this max 30 and literally I've fallen on my face sometimes during this workout. I mean, it is so hard, you know, and you know, I just want you to realize that when you're working out and you push yourself and you fall on your face, realize that the next time you're going to be a little bit stronger because you've reached your max and let that inspire you to um to use that perseverance in other aspects of your life you know our health journeys are so important because they allow us to be the best version of ourselves they allow us to be the best mother the best wife the best sister the best daughter the best friend you know so when you take care of yourself you are a better version of yourself and and realize that when you fall down and when you hit your face literally hits the gravel or hits the you know hits the carpet in your house know that you can get back up and let that you know determination that spirit of perseverance guide you through all aspects of your life you know and let that allow you to chase your dreams you know all the time people are telling us what to do how to live our lives and it's really easy to live a life based on what someone else wants for you and I want you guys to use this challenge to reconnect with what makes you feel alive what makes you feel amazing and chase that you know don't let anyone you know, tell you what you sh how you should live your life. You know, you decide that you're doing this challenge. You better yourself every day and reconnect with what you're doing on this planet, how you're going to make a difference, how you feel great, and um, chase your dreams, guys. I'm here every single day showing up to inspire you. You guys inspire me. This is a community. Anyone else is welcome to record videos and inspire everyone else. If there's breakthroughs that you have, make sure to post them. And um, just like I said, you know, commit, be patient. If you do fall down, if you do have that problem, like I fell down when I gained that weight, I didn't feel great about myself, but I persevered and I kept trying and I kept trying and I kept trying until I figured out a solution. And that's where I am today. And I'm feeling great again. And I'm sharing what's working for me now, you know? So just, just know that, you know, the path is going to be windy, but you guys can do this. I love you. Stay strong. If you need help in anything, message me, email me. I'm here for you. We're a community. We work together. I love you all. Let's rock this. We're already one week down. We have four more weeks to go starting Monday. I know some people are starting Monday. Good luck to all of you. Take your before measurements. Take your before photos. I've been loving all the emails I've been getting with your before photos and emails and questions. So keep them coming, guys. You got this. Rock this. I love you. Take care.